When it comes to visual-based marketing, image carousels are known to generate more engagement than single image or single video posts. On Instagram, after a user is interacted with a carousel post, they are 75% more likely to visit the link store site. And when it comes to Facebook dynamic ads, carousel engagement is 10 times higher than traditional picture ads and the click-through rate increases by 72%. So to help you swipe past all the hard work previously needed to use image carousels on your site, we just released the new image carousel block into Zipify pages. Now, you can use this standalone block to boost engagement on your homepage, collection pages, product pages, promotional pages, and more. And since each image has its own setting to customize, you can target and achieve specific goals based on the setup of your carousel. This means that you can have multiple images with multiple purposes, like adding products to the cart, linking to another page or section of a page, and collecting leads. To start using the new image carousel block, go to the Zipify Pages Builder and open up the block library. Click the images section and select the image carousel. This will add the carousel to the page and open the pop-up for the image carousel settings. Under the images section, click add images to choose which images will show in the carousel. You can use previously uploaded images, upload new images from your device or via a URL, or you can use some of the free images from the Unsplash Images library. In total, you can add up to 50 images to your carousel. Confirm your choices to finish the setup. To edit the position of your images in the carousel, return to the images section and drag and drop your images to their new location. Save the changes and move on to the display section of the carousel pop-up. This section lets you set the number of images is first shown in the carousel for each type of device. On desktops, you can modify the size of the column and slideshow timer options. For tablets, you can adjust the column in the column size. And mobile has dynamic sizing, allowing only for the number of images in the column to be changed. Once you have your desired layout, save your changes and return to the Zipify Pages Builder. Next, you can further customize your images by clicking on one. The additional image settings will appear in the left side tab. You can crop your image, set the destination, style the shape and border, add a hover state animation, and more. To set the function and purpose for the image beyond generating engagement, you'd visit the destination section and choose one of the listed options there. Lastly, you can edit the block setting by clicking on the white space of the carousel or by clicking on the pencil icon in the top right of the block. Here's where you can select the device visibility, width, alignment, padding, and the background color. Finalize the settings by publishing or updating the page. Now, go see your live page and test out your finished product. If you're a Zipify Pages user, please leave us an honest review in the Shopify App Store. It helps us to connect with other users like you. Not using Zipify Pages just yet? Visit zipify.com to start your free trial today. I'm Brittany. Thanks for watching.